I do not feel like a mentor to Guardiola. I think he's uh, probably the person who he admired the most in uh, world football. And another thing which distinguishes him as a top coach is that um, uh, what he proposes uh, he, he's able to implement. And I don't know too many coaches, in my humble opinion, who uh, would also be deserving of this type of praise. I think he's uh, the most authentic manager, uh, the, how he conducts his teams. There's a manager who's independent in his ideas, that, that is Guardiola. Nobody can imitate him, it's impossible. He's unique. So these two teams meet for the first time since 2004. Leeds United actually have an excellent record against Manchester City at Ellen Road. Played five times, won five times, but will they be able to do the same here this afternoon? It looks a really daunting task. Belgian international gives the signal and ready to swing the ball. He swings it goalwards and he hits the post. And Melier is so relieved to see that free kick come back off the post there because he was beaten all ends up. You could see actually the water spin up as the ball rolled towards Melier there, almost a little too slowly for um, calmness as Mendy attacks and tries to play a ball through the middle. Cooper can just stab it into the path of Torres. Now on the edge of the penalty area and into the penalty area, Sterling, for, Sterling opens up and he drives the shot and he scores the goal. And the goal that Manchester City have been threatening almost since the off here has arrived and Raheem Sterling curls the shot beyond the dive of Melier and the away side are in front. Up in the Manchester City half, turns inside of Sterling, keeps going Cleek up to the edge of the penalty area. There's Patrick Bamford just outside the D, tees up for Tyler Roberts. Tyler Roberts into Stuart Dallas and Dallas sees his effort on goal, saved by Edison who was the last line of defence for Manchester City and that was a terrific chance created by Leeds United. Cooper plays the ball out towards the oncoming Ailing. Ailing's got inside of Mendy, Mendy's made a terrible error. Luke Ailing, oh my goodness me, what a save that is from Edison. Luke Ailing had done everything right and he'd got himself clean through on goal and the keeper kept the shot out. Leeds come again with Cleek. And it's cleared up towards the halfway line. And Luke Ayling knows that as the half-time whistle blows, that was the moment. And Rodrigo comes on to replace Roberts. So 20 on, 11 off. Tyler Roberts heads towards the dugout down below us. Ball is won by Helder Costa off a loose header. Lovely back heel. Now Cleek has run a wide left side is Rodrigo. Rodrigo's just outside the penalty area. He's into the penalty area. Rodrigo, step over. Can he get a shot in? Yes, he can. And Edison with a fine save to push that one over the crossbar because that was right up in the top corner. So corner kick taken by Phillips. Edison comes and flaps and it's in! It's score, it's a goal for Leeds United. And Rodrigo scores his first goal for his new club. Error by the goalkeeper. And the Spanish international pounced and drove the ball in from close range. And Leeds are level with Manchester City. 1-1. Down the right-hand touch line on the overlap. Gets the ball into the Manchester City penalty area. Bamford goes, Rodrigo! Oh, what a save that is! Leeds have got to be alert at the other end. And Sterling's got away from Koch. And it's 1v1 as Sterling into the penalty area. Melier goes down. Melier's got his hands <laughs> on the ball. And now Manchester City picking it up right through the, road, through the middle with Rodri. Into the penalty area with Raheem Sterling. And Raheem Sterling goes down. The referee looks long and hard. The referee gives nothing. As the whistle goes, Leeds United claim a point. And what a big point that could prove to be. Marcelo Bielsa almost sinks to the turf, looks down at the ground. But he will know, Marcelo Bielsa, that that is as good a performance as his Leeds United side have put in. With the missed chances, even a little bit of regret that you, you didn't win the game? No hubiera sido justo que ganemos el partido. It, it wouldn't have been fair if we had won the match. Hubiera sido posible, pero no justo. It would have been possible, but not fair. He, he said to me, what is your opinion about the game? And I said, after one second, I'm not able to, I'm not able to analyze the game. Maybe so he's 
you know, more, much cleverer than me. I am not. I need time to process 